All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Blue Lock episode 15. Um, in the last episode, we had the kind of second rivalry battle, I think, um, between Nagi and Asagi versus Baro and Naruheya. Naruheya, Na Naruheya, I believe. Um, definitely a good start to the match, although uh, Baro and now Na Naruheya are kind of catching up. Naruheya is getting in um, Isagi's head saying uh, the reason why I wanted to fight you was because I thought I could win because uh, he's not necessarily trash but uh, he's seen how he operates firsthand meaning he knows kind of his weaknesses and his yeah, what, what he's good at so he's really getting around him now and he's definitely getting in his head and uh, yeah Isagi needs to step it up here because I mean let's be real he's not going home but Isagi doesn't know that yet so um, yeah, I'm excited to see what happens here. Looking forward to seeing how this match c comes out and how, well, Baro will join Nagi and Isagi, presumably. But yeah, anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, goalie got it again. Let's go, Blue Lock Man. Oh, that man Baro's coming. He's an unstoppable force. Average Joes with opposite problems. Wow. I love it how we've seen with both average Joes and he's literally the main character. But in this world, he is. I can't wait till Isagi fi figures out how to fix this insecurity and get good in this. Oh, he's still relying on Nagi, bro. Does the amount the amount he's questioning himself? I do not know what he needs to be to get good in this, like, which is, is part of the problem. I have no clue what's going to secure him a better spot in Blue Lock. Yo, that's cool, cool way of showing that. Let's fucking go, Nagi. Oh shit. That boy is on you. Bro, Nagi is freaking clutch. What a teammate to have. Both Nagi and Barra have got the demon in them. They're just going shot for shot here. Oh, did something click? I was just about to say something is about to click. What is it? What is it, Isagi? That's a good tactic. Okay, so focusing on what you can do when you don't have the ball. All right. I think I thought that would already be obvious, but yeah, makes sense. Why don't you purposely create a blind spot and then you'll lead him into it? Just like Rin did, yeah. Officer ball. The way he says that sounds like he's saying a stand or something. Oh, he's rebuilding himself. That's a really cool visual. Got Blue Lockman taking the knee right now. Respect. Is he listening? Nah, he's evolving, bro. Nah, nah, let, let him cook. Let him cook. I need you to shut up, genius. Hey, fucking yo. Let him cook, Nagi. He's about to snap. Okay, Striker. Bro, that's so cool. Oh, no. Not the sad backstory. No. Bro, they look bussing. With cryptocurrency, yeah. These kids. Damn, it is going to suck to see this man get kicked out of blue luck. Oh, the backstory. Oh, they lost their parents? Fuck. You know what? I, I was saying, like, I don't know if I said this in a previous video, but I was thinking it. I didn't say it. Playing for Japan isn't everything. You can play for a different national team. You know? You'll still make great money. Oh, what is this? Yeah, he's been holding on to it. 
It's a good luck charm. Oh, because they're poor. Ah, oh, oh no. Oh, this is gonna suck. Is Barrow even listening to you right now? Nope. You don't give a fuck. Barrow's so self-obsessed. He tries it anyway. Oh my god, it's going for the other corner. Oh my god. I mean, that wasn't his spot, so yeah, he missed. Barrow doesn't realize how much Naruhaya has riding on this. Like, if Barrow loses, he knows he's going to be chosen anyway. I don't know if not passing right now is a good decision, but... Nope. That might have just cost you your blue lock spot, bro. Average Joe multiplied by average Joe. Baron needs to change his mindset. Like, even if Baro joined the Japan national team with how he is now, no one on the team is going to fucking like him at all. Oh, let's go, Isagi. Come on. Are you going to juke him? Okay. Oh, look at that. He looked fucking epic. Emulated is enough. You have to go beyond. Plus ultra. Let's fucking go, Isagi. So he, he took his skill. He emulated his shit and made it better. Fuck, man. This is going to suck. And we're going to see this more and more going forward, too. He's going to regret that for life as well. Isagi's different, bro. It's almost like he's the main character. You're a pretty good Joe. A genius of adaptability. Wow. He's going to pick Varro, right? Yeah. Why do you look so surprised, bro? I was thinking for a second that he was going to pick Narahaya. I think, like, that wouldn't have been the best bet. You really have to just be a part of the corpse pile or standing on top of it, bro. Aww. I still hope he does something good of his life in regards to soccer. If he's not playing for the national team, playing for, like, one of the best Japanese teams or playing for a different country's team, that'd be awesome. I want to see them all succeed in soccer. Man, that sucks. Well, Barrow, welcome to the team. Yeah, Rio, of course. Oh god, I hope these three don't go up against our three. That'd be a... Ooh, that'd be a crazy battle. Oh god, these three have to share a room now. <laughs> oh, this is quite the team. They're both hella tall, actually. I think uh, Nagi said he was like over 190 or something. I think y'all should fight each other. Former king. <laughs> oh my god, these two are so funny. Hey, <laughs> Sagi just getting involved. Right, so that was Blue Lock episode 15. Epic ass episode. It was very unfortunate for Naruhaya, but that's how this shit is. Um, yeah, it's good that I, we we he didn't need Isagi's pity. This is like a free for all death match, um, and I really liked Isagi's ability to kind of adapt to this. Uh, the way the way kind of Naruhaya explained it was perfect. A genius of adaptability. That is exactly what a good team needs. Um, and yeah, Isagi just snapped on it. Baru, Nagi, and Isagi is a kind of demonic team, to be honest, if they can work together properly. Um, Baru, having Baru on the team kind of throws a spanner in the mix, but hopefully they can work it out. Uh, I, I don't know how I feel about them potentially going up against Chigiri, um, Kunigami, and Ryo. Like, I don't know how it works kind of past here, but um, yeah, they need to fight and 
I guess if the other team loses, they just continue the cycle. I don't know. Maybe they don't. Maybe they get kicked out here. I'm not sure. But um, yeah, overall, a very good episode. Uh, I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.